Welcome back to my channel. Today we will be doing a end of month flip for my Louis Vuitton PM agenda. So this is the small ring agenda. It has pocket size inserts. I think it's been a while since I updated you guys on this. This is my on the go slash travel agenda. I am going to have to switch it up because I did pack all of my PM inserts and so I'm not going to have access to them for a month and I realized I never switched out my um daily inserts. So that's a whole other thing. I'll do a setup video for the PM this month just because I'll actually be, I've been using it more since I've been out right running errands. Um, anyway, so here is the current look. So I have just a mixture of cards over here. So I have my student ID, um, a travel card, and then this is my health insurance card. And then in the back, just like stickers. This is, I don't even know what this is. Um, anything that I've needed on the go, right? So this lives in my backpack. Um, or whatever purse I'm using and so I can write in any appointments that are going on. I have monthly inserts which I haven't used and I think it's because I just haven't set them up each month. So when I start doing my monthly setups with in my uh, medium ring, I'm going to start doing it in the PM as well. I think that's what I did in January and that's why I was able to set them up. This month I'll have a whole dedicated video on it and it'll be like a little reset for the PM as well because like I mentioned I have to take some inserts out. Um, but yeah, so for February, I don't think there's much in here. Yeah, I didn't use it at all, unless I like referenced it for the month. So that's fine. Um, I don't force myself to use all of my inserts just because then you get too stressed about your planner, right? Um, but yeah, I have the entire year in here. And then I have the agenda refills. And so these are the um, daily agenda refills from Louis Vuitton. And so I'll just come in here and I'll write in like if I'm writing, I'll do checklists, I'll write in appointments, pretty much anything that I need to reference or know on the go. And it's very simple. It's very like to the point. I have travel plans in here. I'll set up any like if I have reservations, I'll put that in here. Uh, it's literally anything time sensitive. So that way when I'm like at an appointment, I need to schedule a follow up. Um, I have three months typically at a time, right? So we have January, February, and then March. If I need anything beyond that, I have the full year for the monthly and I can throw that in here. That hasn't been the case. Um, but yeah, let's see. I don't think there's anything much in February. And then here's March where I've been... Uh, had a lot of appointments recently, so yeah, that's what I keep in here, and then that's it. So I had notes in here in the past, but I didn't really use them, and so I think for the month of March, or I'm sorry, for the month of April, again, this planner will look a little different, but haven't fully decided yet. Um, for now, this has just been a little reference agenda and I do like having it on me so I can like also store appointment cards in here. So if they give me one, I'll just throw it in here. You'll see a few here. Um, those are appointment cards. So it's nice to have everything all in one spot. And then once it's in here, I can move it to my other planners if I've like copied everything down. So yeah, other than that, that is going to be it. For, that is the setup and that is going to be it for this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to let me know. And thank you guys so much for watching.